Hey everyone, Chris Barron here. It's Monday, August 5th, and it's time to take a look at the weekly market stats. But first, happy BC Day. Happy long weekend, everyone. I hope you're all outside enjoying the beautiful weather, hitting the beaches or hiking through the forests. I know I couldn't stay inside a minute longer today, so I had to set up outside to, uh, to do this video and to, and to work, quite honestly. It's too beautiful out. It's I gotta love BC, gotta love Vancouver Island. But let's take a look at these market stats. I've got the information right here. Uh, when looking at last week or the week prior for Parksville Qualcomm Beach, that week is July 22nd to 28th, we saw 49 new listings, 21 pendings and solds, and an active listing count of 634. This week, uh, this past week, July 22nd to August 4th, we actually have an active listing count of 605, so down a little bit, uh, you know, about 30 units. Uh, but our new and pendings haven't changed that much. We had a new listing count of 49 and a pending and sold of 20. So pretty much the exact same number. So obviously a lot of expired and cancels coming off the market there, which makes sense for the end of the month. Let's head down to Nanaimo. Uh, last week, or the week prior, sorry, July 22nd, 28th, remind you, we had 77 new listings down there, 30 pendings and solds, and an active listing count of 849. Well, this past week, July 22nd to August 4th, uh, we had new listings of 86, pendings and solds of 26, and an active listing count of 826. So again, down about 20 units, uh, but the real numbers not changing too much. A few news, uh, less sold, so some actives, uh, sorry, some cancels and expireds uh, making the numbers go down there as well. A few things to touch base on. Last week, uh, the BC government announced the Residential Tenancy Act changes for uh, eviction notice for tenants. So it, what was originally slated as a four-month eviction notice for people moving into a home, so homes that have sold, is now down to three months. So that only counts if, you, if you're a buyer and you're purchasing a, a home that has a tenant in it. It's three months notice instead of four. Uh, that's going to be effective August 21st. And I still want to remind everyone that if you are evicting a tenant for personal use or close family personal use, you still have to give them four months notice. And uh, my bigger monthly look at the market stats will be coming out soon. It's again, it's the beginning of the month, just compiling some of that data. So stay tuned for when that will hit my YouTube channel and all my socials. Until then, if you have any questions about the market or you are looking to buy or sell in Parksville, Qualcomm or Nanaimo, please reach out. You can visit my website, chrisbarron.ca, or you can phone me directly at 250-947-5921. Have a lovely BC day, everyone.